What's your thought on the Steam controller? Having like trackpads on a controller and then claiming that you can play RTS just because it has the same like DPI or something or close to it as a mouse is just retarded to me because like first of all that has nothing to do with the mechanic of like moving your hands like this and having to select things like that rather than just clicking a mouse like it's it's not practical but it might turn out to be something cool and I might just be like hating on it for no reason so I don't know I like the fact that Valve is doing their own machine though because Steam is so cool you like it's really cool to be able to like the way they have it set up um, and the way the controller works is anything that even doesn't have controller support, you can play it now. So pretty much everything you have on Steam, anything your friends have gifted you, anything you've gifted other people, everyone can play them like sitting on their couch. And I think that's a cool idea, but I don't think it's possible to make it precise enough to play RTS games on a console. That's just... I don't think it's point. I don't think it's point. I was reading you have a point. Yeah. Steam, the client, I used to hate, but now I love it. Especially because I have over 66 games on there, and I haven't spent a dime because you guys are amazing. I have so many games to play. I have never been this happy before to get things as a gift, and it's just because, fuck yeah, video games, you know? I just want more to play for the first time. I love how Dongregu is playing, and his stream is, Welcome, stranger! What do I think about Ben Affleck as a new Batman? Don't ask me that question. I'm in love with Ben Affleck. I have been forever. So, I would fuck the shit out of that dude. You don't even know. So, you know I'm for it. Like, okay, honestly, thinking about it from an, as an outsider, if Ben Affleck is as bad an actor and as goofy as everyone says, he still has a better, like, lower face for it, and he's taller and bigger than Christian Bale. Like, Christian Bale got pretty fit for it, but if Ben Affleck can get fit for it, he has a much better face for it, in my opinion. Like, he has a more, like, manly jaw and stuff like that. Justin Bieber is Robin. Justin Bieber needs to take a dick in his ass, like, to be honest. He's awful. How do I like the rain? I like rain. The rain was crazy today, though. I was actually driving up to the Theros release to get myself a booster box. And, yeah. It was crazy. <laughs> Uh, favorite band, Pink Floyd. That's my favorite band of all time. I don't listen to it as much as I used to because I'm really into, like, the heavy, heavy metal at the moment. And it's better for, like, working out and streaming, so I just end up listening to it more. But Pink Floyd, oh my god. The melodies. It's like heaven. Maybe next time play Donkey Kong 64. That sounds like fun. I need to start up my retro night. I used to do a retro night every Sunday night where I would stream, um, like, Let's Plays of my favorite retro games. I finished um, Sonic 3, Donkey Kong Country 2, uh, what else did I finish, uh, what was it, Super Mario Bros. 3, um, and Crash Bandicoot. How much weed do I smoke? I haven't smoked weed in like two or three months, and before that like five years, so none, basically. Oh, I'm excited about Batman Arkham Origins because... Deathstroke's gonna be in it, and I've been watching Arrow. So I'm like, oh, Deathstroke. Deathstroke sounds like the naughtiest shit. Like some guy who's just like totally into his masturbation. And he, that last stroke was that Deathstroke. Man. <laughs> I'll leave you guys with that. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to follow my stream, subscribe if you'd like to support me, and subscribe to my YouTube channel, which is the best.